Now I'm going to go over how to change your wallpaper and use the dynamic color and the new material you, des you design here in Android 12 on a Pixel device. So first we have to go into all wallpaper settings and to do that you can just go ahead and tap and hold on any blank space on your home screen till this menu pops up and you want to go ahead and tap wallpaper and styles. Once you do that you get into your uh, wallpaper and style options and you can see with the wallpaper I already have, I have some adjustments I can make. But the first thing we're gonna do is we're actually gonna change the wallpaper so you can see how these options down at the bottom will also change. So I do change wallpaper, you can select um, wallpapers from Google themselves or you can do my photos at the top, go to photos and select any of the photos that you have. So you can see I'm getting a little preview here of what my home screen might look like. Um, I can also tap lock screen to see what the lock screen will look like. And it's taking colors from this image to go ahead and pick the certain accent colors such as the uh, color of the numbers on the clock here. So we can also hit the arrows down here to get a bigger preview. And we can move the image around and zoom in and zoom out to kind of line it up how we want it. Then we can just hit the check mark and we can say we want this to be the home screen or the lock screen or both. I'm gonna set it up as both. And once you've done that, you can see not too much has changed, but if I swipe down from here, you can see the accent colors here kind of match some of the tones here. But if you don't like the colors it originally picked, you can jump back into wallpapers and styles and you can see you have more options down here that will adjust to different colors and different accents in different places. You can also choose the basic colors if you want to just put one accent color across the board here, but you can do the ones that also have multiple like this. You can also see what it'll look like with dark theme on. So you can do that and you can turn that back off from here too. You can also do themed icons and that's gonna adjust the app icons on our screen to themed icons that'll match our color to give it a little bit more of a unified look, but that will only work with apps that support it. So most default Google apps um, do work with that and you can see kind of the zoom one does not because it doesn't support it yet. And then the last thing you can do here is adjust the app grid um, to fit how many apps you kind of want on the screen here. So let's do that one. We'll click apply and here we are on the home screen. And you can see now um, my apps and stuff are a little bit different color. My bar down here um, has some different accents with the Google logo and things like that. If you swipe down here, I also have these colors here. And you can see my themed icons, but again, only icons that have been updated for the material you design will change with that themed icon. As you can see, Zoom does not, but all these classic kind of Google apps do. So you can go back and you can Again, adjust this to kind of however you want um, to get different colors in different places. You can also change the wallpaper to something else. So if I go in here and I go and change the wallpaper to something that has a little bit more green and blue, you can see how it's already gonna change some of those, those icons to blue and my accents have kind of changed and so has that. And I'll click the check and I'll save it as both again. And here you go, you can see it's changed. And so my accent colors have changed due to the colors that are in my wallpaper. Again, I can go back and select these different options that it gives me here. If I want something with more green or more of a lighter blue, um, you can do that. And you can see it changes the stuff up here too in your quick settings. And again, you can see what it looks like in dark mode. I'm going to leave it with the green because that's what I prefer. 
I jump back here, it looks pretty nice. So that's how you can go ahead and use Material U and based on your wallpaper and the dynamic colors and all that kind of fun stuff here on Android 12 on a Pixel device. Hopefully this video helps, and if it does, go ahead and leave a like down below and subscribe to the channel to get more videos like this one on how to make your technology work better for you. Thanks.